The immense pressure of supercooled water fatally destabilized the ice dam at Glacial Lake Missoula. Then massive chunks of ice within the dam began to fall into the raging torrent until the whole dam just gave way. The collapse of the ice dam released a sea of water. This water then traveled up to 60 miles per hour, rushing headlong towards the scablands. It took only a few hours for the water to reach this once flat landscape. In places, the water was a staggering 800 feet deep. As this volatile torrent flowed ever more quickly, it gouged out miles of rock. It carved out cliffs and canyons, including the massive feature that is known today as Dry Falls. Meanwhile, Huge underwater tornadoes were blasting out potholes. The bubbles that formed these tornadoes imploding with enormous force and penetrating deep into the bedrock below. As the chunks of ice from the original glacier were carried huge distances by the floodwaters, the boulders they contained within were randomly flung aside. When the floodwaters receded and the icebergs melted, they would reappear scattered all over the scablands. 